So here in this video, I'm going to talk about what are the major cardiac complications in patients with COVID-19 and how often do they occur. The cardiac manifestations are pretty much common in hospitalized patients and occur more frequently in critically ill patients. And uh, when we talk about the most common complications of the cardiovascular system in COVID-19 infection will be, there will be an elevated uh, troponin levels, which is considered to be an important biomarker of myocardial injury. And this will occur in approximately 10 to 30 percent of the hospitalized patients. In the majority of these patients, cardiac signs and symptoms are not present and the cause of troponin rises not acute myocardial infarction. But however, patients with a clinical presentation that is including the history or electrocardiogram suggestive of acute myocardial infarction require prompt evaluation as well as to treatment. Usually the troponin elevation in COVID-19 patients is mainly due to other causes of myocardial injury including stress cardiomyopathy, hypoxic injury, myocarditis, right heart strain or maybe because of microvascular dysfunction and systemic inflammatory response syndrome. For those without suspected acute myocardial infarction, further evaluation is focused on testing expected to impact the management. So now I want to list out some of the other important cardiac manifestations without elevation of the troponin levels. So arrhythmias have been reported approximately in 5 to 20 percent of the hospitalized patients of COVID-19 and most are asymptomatic and the causes of these arrhythmias may include hypoxia or maybe due to abnormalities in the electrolytes that is electrolyte imbalance, myocardial injury and the drugs which may affect the QT interval such as QT prolonging agents. And one of the important uh, condition that is heart failure is the most common symptomatic cardiac complication of COVID-19 hospitalized individuals who are critically ill. And the data on its incidence are pretty much limited from the research papers. However, its presence is mainly associated with an increased mortality. And the heart failure in patients with COVID-19 may be precipitated by acute illness in patients who are with pre-existing known or undiagnosed heart disease, maybe the coronary artery disease or hypertensive heart disease or incident of acute myocardial injury. Example may be stress cardiomyopathy or maybe acute myocardial infarction. So these are the most important cardiovascular complications what we are experiencing in hospitalized critically ill COVID-19 individuals.